balancing a social life, practice, and homework. Being a student athlete isn't easy, and tonight we introduce you to a certain young woman fighting more than just algebra. Adversity. Athletes know it well. Overcoming the odds and making the comeback. But sometimes in life, an athlete's obstacles aren't on the court. I mean, being diagnosed with cancer and then, like, you know, blowing out my ACL all in my freshman year is <laughs> just not the best, not what I was expecting. Alex is a setter for the Minot State University volleyball team. She missed all of the 2012 season with a torn ACL, and then in February, matters got worse. I have two kinds of cancer. I have thyroid cancer as well. They asked if I was exposed to extreme radiation when I was younger or something because it's so rare. It's normally found in 50-year-olds. Doctors found a malignant tumor the size of a racquetball in Alex's parietal lobe, the part of the brain that processes speech and spatial orientation, which will make her return to the court more difficult. Um, I've lost a little bit of peripheral vision in my left eye, and I don't know if that's really going to make a difference, but I might have to start compensating, and I'm going to be extremely rusty. Like my surgeon said, we just have to take it like one step at a time. Alex is currently back home in Arizona, recovering and watching the medical bills pile up. Meanwhile, back in Minot, her teammates, with some help from the community, do what they can to help her out. All the volleyball girls uh, wanted to do something for her, and they came to us and asked us uh, if we could help them with a benefit. For a week, Tutti Frutti took donations and pitched in a portion of their own proceeds to help Alex. They raised over $2,300, and even though that's just a drop in the bucket, it's the thought that counts. I just can't believe it. Like, my family and I are just so incredibly grateful. We can't believe the amount of support and love that we're receiving from Minot State. Like, my parents are just like, we are so happy you picked this school. And, like, I, the, the Tutti Frutti thing is just unbelievable. What's even more unbelievable is how well Alex is handling this obstacle. For KX Sports, I'm Derek Hackett. Alex expects to be back in the Magic City for the fall semester, but doesn't expect to return the court until the 2014 season.